Welcome to Comedy Global. There is EV revolution in the country. Electric cars, electric scooters and electric buses are at the forefront of luxury and energy efficiency. But listen, EV vehicles needing hours to charge their batteries to continue their journey is about to change. Yes, here comes the aluminium energy revolution. With the completion of this research jointly conducted by India and Israel, aluminium air technology will power electric batteries in EVs. India and Israel are currently working on aluminium air technology. Tata Motors and Mahindra and Mahindra have a pilot project in Israel. If all goes well, the hope is to create a revolution in the auto industry and the oil industry. Industry experts told media while speaking on the sidelines of Auto Expo 2023 that kick-started in Uttar Pradesh's Greater Noida on Friday. IOC Finergy Limited IOP, a 50-50 joint venture of Indian Oil Corporation Limited IOCL with Finergy Limited, has showcased its first ever full ecosystem for aluminium air energy in India, including R&D, manufacturing and associated services at Auto Expo 2023 at Greater Noida. It has displayed India's first ever vehicles powered by aluminium air system at Auto Expo, the motor show, which is being held in Greater Noida. Aluminium air technology uses aluminium as an energy carrier for on-demand zero-emission energy generation. Aluminium as a metal has had an existing production, transportation and recycling value chain for over a century. With the availability of indigenous aluminium in abundance supported by a well-established aluminium industry, aluminium used as an energy carrier has the potential to disrupt the e-mobility landscape in India. As an energy carrier, aluminium has a very high energy density of 8 kilowatt hour per kg which translates into long range for EVs. Moreover, aluminium air systems for EVs are grid independent and do not require charging. As they go, the petrol pump fills the fuel in our cars which takes a few minutes. The idea is to reload the aluminium energy at the petrol pump in just a few minutes. They essentially use the energy stored in this lightweight, durable and safe metal and whenever energy reloads is required, it can be done in a few minutes. IOCL's Executive Director Sanjeev Gupta told media. Aluminium India mein bahut se milta hai. and India is a leading supplier of aluminium. Ka. So this is technology, this is aluminium air technology. Hai. Isme एक कैथोड होता है वो कैथोड एक प्रोप्राइटरी कैथोड है जिसके अंदर से जब एयर पास होती है तो वो एयर के अंदर से ऑक्सीजन को सेपरेट कर देती है और ये ऑक्सीजन एनोड जो एल्युमिनियम का है उसके से रिएक्ट करती है और रिएक्ट करके इलेक्ट्रिसिटी का प्रोडक्शन होता है और इसके बीच में एक इलेक्ट्रोलाइट भरा हुआ होता है जो एक केओएच सॉल्यूशन होता है इस टेक्नोलॉजी में ये होता है कि जब पूरा एल्युमिनियम कंज्यूम हो जाता है फिर हम एक नई प्लेट डाल देते हैं तो जैसे एक आज के डेट में एक गाड़ी हमारे पेट्रोल पंप पे आती है वो दो मिनट रुकती है उसमें हम पेट्रोल भरते हैं गाड़ी चली जाती है इसमें सेम चीज़ होगी गाड़ी हमारे पेट्रोल पंप पे आएगी उसके बाद हम एक उसमें नया स्टैक लगा देंगे एल्यूमिनियम का उसका पुराना केयर सॉल्यूशन बाहर निकाल लेंगे फ्रेश भर देंगे दो मिनट में गाड़ी वापस चली जाएगी Gupta added that IOP has partnered with leading Tata Motors and Mahindra and Mahindra in India and the pilot project is going on in Israel by integrating its aluminium air batteries in electric vehicles. IOP has demonstrated about 500 km range in a continuous drive of AI air integrated EVs in India. IOP has also successfully shown the AI air technology for energy backup applications at the sites of a leading telecom tower company in India. Finergy and IOP have partnered with Hindalco in India on R&D and pilot production of aluminium plates for aluminium air batteries and recycling of aluminium after usage of these batteries without any loss. Aluminium air powered EVs enjoy no grid dependency, lower capital cost and up to five times the range of EVs powered by traditional batteries and it's all made in India supporting an Atmanirbhar Bharat. Talking exclusively to ANI, David Mayer, CEO of Finergy said, what we hope to achieve is to introduce metal air technology based Based on aluminium plates coming from the ground here in India. Produced by Hindalco, a circular economy of it can be done here in India and that would be the biggest difference we can do. David said that this is made in India completely, the manufacturing is made here in India. An aluminium plate of 600 grams produces 2.5 kilowatt hours of energy and will drive a vehicle up to 25 kilometers. David said, we are doing it with a three-wheeler, a four-wheeler, we'll do it with buses and we are going to bring a change here to India together with our partners, Indian Oil Corporation and the fuel coming from the ground of India alone. We all have already 10% of the infrastructure there and we are on a daily basis and already installing systems. Now it's a product certified in Israel, certified in Europe and it will be certified in 
India and the US. Responding to a question about when we can see it happening in India, David said, we are now going to scale up things very fast. Now that everybody believes that this is true, once when you look at metal, you think this is just metal. Now people look at this, they think of energy. So now things will scale up much faster. This is Anjana signing off. Do like and share this video. For further updates, subscribe to Comedy Global.